Asia says her boyfriend's past is coming back to haunt her. Asia, what's going on? Well, Jerry, me and my boyfriend, we've been together for eight months. Yes. And I'm six months pregnant. Oh, congratulations. And thank you. There you go. And it's a girl, and yes. her name is Catalea Jo Brooks Nadine. Who? Yeah. yeah. And during the time, you know, me, I found I was pregnant. Me and John, we were broken up, oh. you know, and I, had, I texted him and told him I was pregnant. But he didn't believe me, so I had to go to, you know, his house and take a pregnancy test in front of him, you know, because he felt that I was lying just to get back with him, but I, see. I wasn't. Yeah. Apparently not. <laughs> yeah. And so ever since then, you know, we had got back together and things have been going great, you know. Good. We he proposed to me, we're engaged. Yes. And you know, we've been getting ready for the baby and stuff like that. Yeah. You know, getting ready for her. So that sounds all like good news. Yes, sir. So what is there a problem? Yes, a month and a half ago, me and him had broken up because he commented on his friend Haley's post and said she had beautiful eyes. Oh, yes. so he has this woman friend. Yeah. Yeah. And that made me mad, you know, like, why would you say she has beautiful that's, eyes yeah, if you're That's friends? flirtatious. Yeah. 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 Okay. You know? And, you know, I asked him about it. He was like, no, it's nothing like that. We're just friends. And I was like, no, friends don't do that. Friends don't say that to each other, yeah. you know? Yeah, yeah. Like, mm -mm, that's yeah. not what friends do. So I broke up with him, and I told him, you know, I'm done. Get out. You know, yeah. and he, he left. And about two weeks ago, you know, he came back to me. He was like, I love you. I want to be with you. I want to oh, work okay. things out for our family and our little girl, yeah. you know. And oh, good. he had to tell me something. And I was like, what is it? And he told me he slept with her. Oh. Yeah. So why are you here now? Are you going to still be with him or what? I plan on it, but I'm here to confront her and to let her know, look, you need to back up, like, yeah. you know, because two days ago she had commented, you know, back to his comment he had made and, you know, being all flurry to him and stuff like that, you know. And so he's admitted that he's cheated on you with her, but he's still saying he wants to be with you. No, we were broken up when that had happened. Oh, I see. Yeah. So... You know, and but you want her to get away to yeah, stay like out of like this. she needs to back up and know her boundaries yeah. and yeah. know that look, he's with me now. He's trying to work things out with me, not with you. You need to stay in your lane and know that he yeah. loves me and not you. He's trying to work things out Got with it. his family. You're just trying to ruin it, you know. Okay, because you're so you're unhappy. here now to tell her to back off. Yes. All right. Well, here she is. Here's Haley. <clears throat> So I'm here to tell you and let you know that you need to back up from John and, you know, stay away from him because he has a family. He's happy now. You just need to, like, stay in your own lane, honey. Okay, but he, he's only with you because you're pregnant. We have eight years together. Y'all have eight months. Okay, but oh. still, just because you think that doesn't mean he feels that way. I don't know how you're feeling about him and why you think that, but you need to get it up out your head. Okay, but he comes to me every time y'all argue, every time y'all fight, and asks me what he should do. And you know what I tell him? That he needs to leave you. Because oh. just because you're pregnant don't mean y'all have to be together. Okay, but he wants to be with me. That's the thing. Just because he comes to you, when, yeah, he's going to come to you when he's mad because... He thinks y'all are just friends. I'm thinking y'all are just friends. You know, he's going to come to you for advice. But you telling him that he don't need to be with me, like, that's just your gateway to try to get in and ruin something that you really can't have. No, baby. I've been in love with him since freshman year in high school, oh. and he tells me he loves me. Okay, just because he tells you he loves you don't mean it's like a relationship-wise. It's a friend-wise. You taking it as he loves you, wants to be with you, relationship type. No, honey, it's not well, for So you're saying you really do want to be with him. It wasn't just like a one It wasn't just said. a one time. I mean, we only had sex one time, but right. I think there's more than just Wow, that. one time, and you feel like whoop-dee-doo-doo. Well, I mean, obviously there's something going on for us to have sex. Okay, he was mad. He probably did it just to make me mad. You know, just to heat the moment. He felt like he needed someone to be there. This well, is what I he mean, told he me. Act like he was mad. <laughs> okay, who is who is Sierra? Oh, that's my friend. Since I'm pregnant and can't whoop her ass, she gonna do it for me. All right, here's Sierra.
friend, and what do you want to say to her? Why in the world would you think that it would be okay to sleep with her bad baby daddy when she's seven months pregnant with his first child? What is the name of your business? She's my best friend and she's pregnant. You know, there's nothing she can do about it. Okay, why don't you go home and worry about your pathetic ass life instead of worrying about what I'm doing? Oh, okay. My pathetic life. So she's. Uh, what she's saying is they've been together for, I mean, they've known each other for eight years. They have that kind of a relationship. But you're saying that's a friendship. He really says he wants to be with you. Yeah, he doesn't Does want he to be ever my... say to you he would like to be with you in a romantic way? I mean, it's come up once or twice. Yeah. Wow, well, once or twice. Yeah, once or twice. Yeah. Compared to my million times, like... Girl, well, y'all been together eight months, please. Okay, y'all been <laughs> friends for eight years. Y'all ain't never dated. Your point? If he really wanted to be with you, he would have been with you a long time ago. You're nothing but a little side. You're nothing but a little sideline whore. Well, let's bring him out. Here's Jonathan. Hey, Jonathan. Yes, sir. Yeah, nice to meet you. Good, you too. Yeah. Sorry you didn't have a chance to get dressed. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it's all right. Uh, so tell me, uh, what's going on? That's your girlfriend. Yeah, baby mama. Yeah. And she says you guys slept together. Yes, yeah, there's no sound chick. Somebody keep on the side. Exactly. What do you want to say to her? I mean, I am in love with you, and I do want to be with you. I mean, I mean we've got eight years, you know, of relationship together. Not I me mean, not being together, but... I, mean, I understand that. So, there's nothing... I don't want to be with her. Don't wrong. I got feelings for her and all. She's a cool girl, but I feel like I got a better future in my baby. What do you want to say to him? I mean, like, what, what's it gonna be? Is it gonna be me or her? I mean, like, you need to make up your mind because apparently you telling her stuff to lead her on and make her believe that you really want to be with her, but you telling me this and making me believe you want to be with me. Like, you, you got us confused here. You need to choose right now because I'm not gonna play them games. To be honest. I mean, I'm on 20. I don't know what I really want yet. I'm just here trying to figure out where I should go in my life. I mean, I work. When I found out you was pregnant, I wasn't even working. I was living on the couch at my best friend's house. So I gave up everything, my music, everything, to make you happy. Your music, what kind of music? I rap. Oh, you rap? <laughs> yeah. Can we hear some? Yeah, actually, I wrote a little something for her. Oh. <laughs> Mistakes made. Lessons learned. I live life, baby girl, it's your time. I ain't asking for a chance. I'm just asking for your hand. Let me show you what is in my head. I'm a different man. I swear to God that I'm serious. Baby, just hit me out. I take you by the hand and I take you to the house. I know it's hard to believe me. I told you so many lies. I set you down and looked you in your face and made you cry. I'm sorry for what I did. Saying sorry, don't <laughs> Now I'm on Jerry Springer and I'm so ready to admit. I look and I'm sorry that I messed up with this chick. I mean, I love you, John, like... Yeah, I love you, too. But life's gonna take its course and see what we gotta do. We both still young. We still got a long life to live. I sitting there telling you, you still thinking about it. I mean, I ain't gonna lie, I got feelings for a girl. She cool as hell, and she got some good sex game. Oh, really? So that's how you feel? I mean, I'm just being completely honest with you. Do subtitles? On... <laughs> <laughs> okay, what you were saying, that you care about her, but... She's still a cool yeah, girl. Yeah, why need something on the side to keep me a little happy, bring back up? Because she got a bad attitude. She's ungrateful. When I feel like she ain't appreciating me, she does. She brings a better outside of me when I feel like she's pushing me back down. Okay, I, then if I put you down, then why would you even come back? Like, why would you even try to waste your time back and my time? I came back in the first place because of my baby. That might not even be his. Okay. I mean, she keeps me going. I mean, when you push me away, she picks me back up. Okay, well, you can have her then. <laughs> Okay, how did it, how did it happen that you two wound up? Well, my cousin asked her, her baby daddy. So I kind of have a little relationship with that, her kids. Yeah, she's trying to so keep I came in up the family. So I came one day to see her kids, spend yeah. a little time with them. Yeah. And we just end up just talking and. Yeah, and there you are. Yeah. yeah. That's a wrap.
Sounds like a slut to me. We'll be back. Yay! Hey, YouTube, thanks for watching. For more Judge Jerry, click here. For more Jerry Springer, click here.